This is James Mathers at NAB 2019. I'm here at the booth for the Studio B&H with my friend Michelle Suisa. And Michelle, uh, you cover all these different products so you can be objective. What do you think is interesting at the show? What are you seeing? Uh, to be honest, the most interesting thing we've seen is what happened in our booth this year. Uh, we've put together a uh, interesting program, we think, we hope, uh, for the audience about education on cinematography. And we've had a number of very interesting speakers, you know, DPs, you know, from our partners at NYFA and members of the ASC. Uh, we've had a DIT, you know, that works on uh, big box office films from Marvel Comics. So it's been really eventful. We've had a, an incredible turnout and we've learned a lot of things from a lot of really interesting people. So that's really been, you know, so far my first three days on AB have been uh, sort of uh, supporting uh, the events that we have here. What products have got your attention? Um, evidently, you know, the uh, Alexa Mini LF in the world of cinema is, you know, sort of taking the world by storm. Uh, anything Ari does takes the world by storm because, you know, it, it's always a, uh, an interesting product, you know, and, and uh, it, there's such a, you know, a vibrant sort of uh, leader in the community. Um, other than that, you know, we really have seen a number of um, new optics you know coming on, on the market you know it seems like uh, there's an abundance of uh, primes uh, whether they're new primes or uh, um, sort of rehouse vintage or what's called the new vintage um, we like uh, the new Canon Sumeri lenses we thought that we think that these will have a good uh, a good life cycle we uh, love the fact that finally uh, Canon uh, pulled out a uh, an important step in their uh, product line, which is to have PL primes. You know, I think that's really important for the community. Um, other than that, you know, close to NAB, uh, one important announcement for us is a new partner, um, Light Cine is now a partner with the studio b &H, and we're very, very happy to have that. Actually, uh, in the booth on Monday, we had a series of presentations on uh, large sensor cameras, almost exclusively using Thalia lenses. So, um, so these are some of the things, you know, that, um, you know, we've, we've been uh, putting together for the show. Another, another sort of important step for us is we've adapted our little fly cam, uh, dynamic cam, cable cam system that is now being adopted even more widely in the world of sports. We've adapted it with a new camera, Sony camera, and a new lens uh, that actually interfaces with directly with uh, Sony RCPs, which is really a, a good step towards integration into broadcast environments. Always a lot of exciting things, yes. and you carry them all. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, and that extends also to across the aisle over there to the South Hall. You know, we have for the second year in a row, we have a presence in the South Hall because that's a really big market for us. Anything that's image processing, post-production, color grading, visual effects, you name it. Anything that runs on a computer workstation, uh, you know, we sort of carry as well. So we've had, you know, some uh, pretty good turnout over there. We're showing any kind of really interesting solutions from from uh, digital dailies, you know, with all kinds of transcoding, decoding, uh, 8K real time, you know, with NVIDIA RTX, all the way to HDR on Resolve. So it, it's pretty substantial. Thank you, Michelle. All right, you're very welcome.